All right, all right, we're good. We do keep the moon shards. I do remember that, so that's that's good at least. Don't have to worry about getting all those again. Just navigate our way back on over here, and we'll be in for we'll be pretty much back where back where we need to be, honestly. Oh, right, bad landing on my part for sure. Now, I see what I think is the moon shard right there. Grab that real quick. That was about the easiest, uh, easiest moon shard of my life. And there we go. I think that's our new, that's our objective that we were looking for. I can't imagine there's going to be too much of use or too much of a uh, interest, except maybe this, in the, hidden in behind these things. Well, there you go. <laughs> I was honestly considering like maybe just uh, don't get out of there. Maybe not even like blowing up the rest of these uh. These crates, because I didn't think there'd be too much of consequence behind them other than like coins and stuff, but to the to the curious go the spoils. In a manner of speaking. Nothing behind that one. I mean now now I'm curious I gotta get all of these. Even though now that I found the one power moon that's behind them. Probably not gonna be too much uh, too much else here. That's alright though, I'm still just having fun. Let me have fun playing my video games, please. Oh, I thought you were going to get blown up. <laughs> That's my bad. All right. Give me this moon, baby. Smart bomb the hell out of this place. I get the feeling that they're slowly teaching me the various mechanics of some big old gauntlet I'm going to have to run at the very end of this kingdom with the Stairface Ogres, the Woodpecker Dudes, the Smart Bombing. The big brutal battle. Oh no. I didn't expect it to come so soon. I still have to, like tw like 74 purple coins to find. All right, this is it's surely not going to be the end. This is like the midway boss, right? We got a lot more after this it seems like. Well, I mean, it looks like that might be the last place. Who knows? There's a power moon right up here waiting just calling my name apparently. Just happened to glance up in that direction, and oh, hello, from the side above the castle gate. I'll take it, dude. I will absolutely take that. There's got to be... Okay, I was going to say there's got to be something atop that big pagoda over there. Is that even the proper word for a pagoda? I think it is. Like that sort of style of roof, that style of building. There's another, like, uh, pecking hole there, too, actually, so... Let me go ahead and try and navigate that. Oh! Little pointed hat got me, buddy. Alright, let's get on up here. Just gotta find all the find the right well the right walls in order to navigate this place. Alright, go ahead and jab my face in here. Well that's that's not it's not a moon, but you know what, I'll take it. Makes up for some of the some of the stupoid deaths I had. go grab all this grab all that and grab these nice little purple coins just waiting here for me beautiful nice little scenic view scenic view of all these vistas we visited already oh hold on did i not get those purple coins i thought i i thought i explored every little rooftop and nook and cranny around here just keeping an eye out it looks like it looks like that's like the last big location although it does look quite big so <laughs> maybe that's where literally everything else is but before we, uh, before we go on with that, oh, hold on. I was gonna say there's there's something there's something down here. Man, they're 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 doing a pretty good job of hiding hiding things here. Oh, all right. Where's this even gonna take me? Is this like a little secret moon area, or is this just like a its own little thing for the purple coins? I've meaning to actually check how many. Oh, there is a moon here. How many uh, moons that we're looking out for here, though? I want to check the check the wire. No, check the check the lists here. See how many. Oh, we might have already missed a couple moons by the looks of it here. Not too sure about that. We'll see. Although, I mean, they're not always in order like that. We got 45 moons to find in this place. It's honestly a lot more than I anticipated, but I'm fine with it, I suppose. So maybe I've maybe I am missing a lot more than I realized in the earlier sections, we'll see. 
We'll see what that comes to. All right. But before we move on to that big brutal battle, oh, get out of here. <laughs> My little bird feet can only carry me so fast. Let's make our way over here. I'm very surprised I did not go on top of this roof, honestly. Seems very unlike me to not explore such an easily accessible area. Can I, like, huh. Oh boy. It's gonna be a little tight. Huh. We got it. We got it, boys. We got it. <laughs> Send them home. There we go. Oh man. That was a little nerve wracking, a little, like, leap of faith sort of deal. But we did it. Can't get on top of this, so let's get out of the way of that. And, uh,. And now we get our way back here. I love the little side flicks, dude. There's something so cute about that. I mean, these, these things are cute in general, don't get me wrong. Bowser keeps some cute pets. That much is for damn sure. Alright, I think I'm pretty well done with this area. I might not literally be, but let's move on anyway. Nice little reprieve here in the garden. The souvenir shop, of course. Look at these little statues, dude. Can I, like, stand here as, like, one of them? Look at me. It's a me, dude. Maybe there's an outfit I can get, and then I can just, like, stand here with that outfit. And then, uh... And then get something there. Okay, there's gotta be something to do with this, right? Surely they wouldn't just have, like... Random little... Tch, random little breakable-looking section there. That's a... Hell of a jump from that trampoline, by the way, or from that umbrella. Just keeping an eye out. There's certainly bound to be something hidden up there. I, I did see that purple coins. What are you wearing, dude? Like, don't get me wrong. It's a very cool hat. I just don't think that it quite matches the the suit. Color me crazy, I guess. Um, before before I talk to you though, I'm just gonna take a quick pit stop back up here. I didn't quite get these. Get out of there. And we're good. Alright, what do you got for me, buddy? You want to get a look? See what's going on inside? You gotta be dressed for battle, friend. You don't look much like a samurai. Well, <laughs> excuse you, dude. If only you know you knew what these friggin' uh, these plumber clothes have been through. Just people, dude. <laughs> I, was, I was so looking forward to some stone face or stair face ogres selling me these wares. Oh, well. Life apart, we got a, the Power Moon, Bowser Kingdom, even ba even Bowser's got to eat, man. Got to spend that money and give it to him. <laughs> Can't believe Bowser has a fucking gift shop, that's so silly. There we go, shopping at Bowser's Castle. Who would have ever guessed? Anything else hidden in here? Nope, got our clown suit and everything. Life apart, you know what, sure, why not? We're about to go into a big battle, presumably, so let's, uh, let's stock up while we can. Knowing this game, there was likely one for free at some point coming up, but... Ooh, the samurai helmet and samurai armor. Wait, hold on. Samurai wore helmets that were functional and win and fancy. The samurai basically walked around wearing works of art <laughs> that were hopefully functional as well. This coiled headband is perfect for when you want to cover just a bit of your head. <laughs> or a traditional clothing designed to be easily... Designed to be easy to move around in at a festival. Really, a happy outfit. Never knew what that specific sort of style was called, I guess. Bowser's Kingdom sticker. A sticker inspired by Bowser's Castle. Got all the classic motifs. You got the Bowser's Castle, you got a Goomba, and whatever the hell that other one is. Paper lantern, of course. These lanterns are found in Bowser's Castle. In the old days, people used to walk around with them like flashlights. Nifty. And the Jizo statue. Found in places all- found placed all over these statue. these guardian deities watch over the travelers in silent protection. Well, while I'm here, I might as well grab, uh, yeah, yeah, we'll grab the samurai outfit, just, and just, normally, like, I know I like to wait to, to until I have all the purple coins and stuff in order to, in order to get everything, but since we're, like, right here, and we've got the, uh, the guy who wants us to be dressed like a samurai, just, like, literally behind the shop here, might as well take care of it, hell yeah, dude. Gotta love those antlers. Let's pop on out of here, and don't worry, I am gonna change back into my 
standard Mario attire. I think it's only fitting for this kingdom to like go because I never, I don't know when I'm gonna end up fighting Bowser here proper. So uh, I want to be dressed for, dressed in my Mario in Mario's best, if you know what I mean. Th that armor, you look like a samurai. Well, step right in. Is this uh, Sakura Khan? Have I made it? What is this? What is this? Excuse me. It's just a pipe here. Oh, hold on. There's a big old slab of something. What am I... What? <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll take the pipe. I thought... I, I, I don't know. I assumed the, I guess I just assumed that the pipe was going to be an exit of some kind. Oh, no! Oh, alright. I mean, easy enough, right? Okay, not so bad so far. Next level, please. <laughs> it's, it's like a, it's a, it's own, like its own little Mario game within a Mario game. I'll take it, dude. Take a little, don't mind a little highfalutin platforming action every now and again. Easy money so far. Imagine there's got to be a secret moon hidden somewhere in and amongst all this. Yep. Yeah. Grab all those. Oh, all right, I'll come back for that last one, don't you worry. Oh, boy. Oh, come on. Oh, oh, did I get it? Oh, my God. That had to have been, like, the last possible moment that that could have happened. Like, for serious. That was, that was way too close. I, I swear I heard it, like, make the little, like, da 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 sound, where it was like, you failed. But I just barely got it. All right. Cool money, dude. I guess that was our quote-unquote, uh, secret moon, then. Okay, well, I guess, I guess that works. <laughs> sort of. There we go. Alright, this shell's gonna come back to bite me real quick here if I don't... Ah! Oh! Of course, dude, get in the friggin' water. Get out of here, we don't need any of your shogun anigans. And we're done. Thanks for the extra couple moons, buddy. I need every little bit of help I can to beat your, uh, your employer here, Bowser. Is Bowser... I mean, he might, he has to be employing these people, right? He has to be paying them in some capacity. I hope. Or maybe he just kidnapped them from a different uh, crazy cap store. And he's like, you work for me now. And if you don't, you're gonna die, so... <laughs> I'll bring the Lord of Lightning down on your ass. Like, what the? I still, I'm still reeling from that, dude. That big old fucking, big fuck you dragon. There's certainly something I can do here. Like, there's got to be a, a Jizo statue that I can like go capture somewhere, and bring here. And there's this too. I don't, I don't know, dude. Maybe it'll maybe it'll all be made more clear once I actually uh, like clear out this kingdom properly, and then come back once the kingdom has changed and evolved, so to say. But without anything else for us around here, let's go ahead and move on, up, up, and away. This looks like the big Kahuna fight itself. Well, not against Bowser, but against the. This is little friends. This is a Jizo statue. It's now a Tanuki Mario statue. I can dash. Are these just like spots that I can stand in order and like <laughs> This is this is pretty good, dude. There's little spots that are like secretly uncovered. This is really <laughs> Is this all this thing can do? Just hop around like this? I mean I'm fine with it. I'll take it, dude. I'll take these coins. Oh. You guys don't stand a chance. I'm sorry. <laughs> Can anything even harm me in this? Oh, there's a painting here. It's not active, but er, there it is. I'll have to remember that when I come back through here, I guess. Smash these paper lanterns, dude. Get them out of here. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Not quite. <laughs> Something hiding right here. Ooh, that's a life up hard. I knew there would be one for free, but I just went and bought one anyway, just in case. You never know. 
I am holding the dash button, by the way. That's it's it's just, it's just that slow. Like this is how it goes without the dash. So Let's count ourselves lucky, I suppose. Hutting around at the speed of at the speed of stomps. So I clearly, I don't think I I'm gonna be able to get this Jizo statue back to the souvenir shop because like clearly it's like way the hell out there and I can't like I can't ride the lightning as a Jizo statue. Man, look at how far we've come, baby. All right, let's uh. Let's take the take the leap here. I'm not, I'm not abandoning the statue. Are you kidding me? I'm like totally invulnerable in this state. It seems like. Why would I not take this with me into the final fight here? The main courtyard entrance. Boy, oh boy. What do you guys got for me, huh? They're not gonna come out until I actually like step out as Mario, are they? I feel like I'm supposed to be encountering someone right now, but. Because I'm a statue. Might as well grab that. I probably should have actually waited because I'm. I think I'm going to be fighting someone real quick here. All right, let's get out of this. It's, it's. We've had our fun with it, I suppose, for now. Hello. Is anyone home? I've come to face off against this lightning god or something. I hear there's a big brutal fight. Oh, there we go. You rang? Oh, it's only two of them. Oh, do I have to fight these two at once? Oh, that'll be interesting. Yep, the wedding's almost here. The boss is getting ready to keep up in the keep up ahead. But you two can scram, because you're definitely not invited. <laughs> okay, I just gotta fight. Maybe I have to fight them back to back here. We'll see. Alright. Bring it on, lady. I can't quite remember exactly what you do. Oh yeah, I gotta knock these bombs back at you, don't I? Something like this. Okay, not quite. Oh boy. Oh! Okay, all right, get him knocked back. Knock him back, knock him back. Yeah, that's the ticket, dude. Destroy your little hat, your little precious primo UFO hat. And she goes nuts with it. I remember this fight now, dude. This is, this is a good time. I love her cackling. Oh my gosh. Oh, don't. Man, she almost faked me out by, like, descending upon me at the last minute there. Can I send those ones back? Or do I, do I just want to... I might just want to wait for the bigger ones, because they're a little easier to send back. So, we'll bide our time here. Get those out of here, dude. Alright. How does she even make those? She's got some magic-ass Rapunzel hair. I've ever seen it. Oh, send it back! Send him! Oh, dude, we missed our missed our golden opportunity. All right. I wonder if I could hit her with one of these. I mean, I imagine you could, but like to aim it properly would be quite a feat, I would assume. Just wait for the big ones, because then those those ones sort of auto aim if you can hit them, just like that. There you go. That's the ticket. Get out of here, girly. Give me your free monies. Okay. <laughs> Give me that, please. Oh. <laughs> you ain't so bad. You made a little star there. Look at that. Come on, girl. I imagine I'm good. I feel like I'm going to end up having to fight every brutal here. Like, I'm going to have to fight this girl. Then I'm going to have to fight the one that was with her. Nice shot, by the way. <laughs> that was uh, very, very, very clearly aimed at me. Alright, you're all done. That's one down. Who's next? Oh my god! <laughs> the Lord of Lightning has been slain. Or the God of Lightning, and then this is the Wind God or something. Got two more Brutals. Up and coming. Oh no, just the one. Just you. You're the last one standing, huh? <laughs> the boss wasn't kidding when he said you two were persistent. But I owe it to my family, to all the da 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 brutals, to come at you with everything I got. So you're the Fred of this mystery gang, huh? 
All right, buddy. Let's do this. We got three fucking hats on top. What? Excuse me? What was that? <laughs> you? F <laughs> no, do it again. Do it again. <laughs> I don't even want to like try and fight him right now, cause that's just funny, dude. <laughs> what are you doing? You, <laughs> you madman! Get out of here! You freaking nerd! Oh my god! <laughs> I don't. Even, is that attack supposed to be threatening, or are you just trying to kill me with laughter? All right, this is a little bit worse. I'll give you this one. This one's a little bit more menacing, at least. Uh, or at least harder to dodge. Like holy hell! Give me these coins. All right. <laughs> Oh, please do it again. Okay, now it's actually gonna be a little bit more daunting, probably, because he's gonna, like, have a- have a- <laughs> It's still not, though. It's still not. Oh my god, especially once you can get him knocked down to, like, one hat. Come on, dude. Oh, I get it. I get- I get how it's supposed to- <laughs> I was just not doing the fight properly, I think. <laughs> Oh, I still love that he just face plants. He just goes down on his face and literally <laughs> It's supposed to be an attack. I, oh my god, dude. Get these things freaking out of here. I can just destroy these, I guess. I'm seriously gonna die of laughter before this guy actually kills. Oh, okay. Oh, he got me. He got me. It's just because he has so many fucking hats now. Some of these out of here, please. Okay. <laughs> I sort of see how the rhythm of the fight is supposed to go now, but it was admittedly <laughs> very hilarious <laughs> yeah, for the first time. I don't remember him doing this the first time I fought him. This must be some new new tactics here. Alright, I gotta be careful though, because I am gonna lose my lose my first heart anyway. <laughs> if I'm not careful. There we go. You're done, buddy. The Brutals were not avenged. Sorry to say. Get him out of here. Can I keep that golden shell, please? Only a single power moon. Man, could have sworn that would have been worth at least a multi-moon. I defeated two Brutals. Oh, well, we'll take it. We'll take it all the same. Big Brutal battle. All right, and in we go. Deeper still into Bowser's Keep. Showdown at Bowser's Castle. Oh boy. Well, you know what? I think, oh, we recovered, yay. <laughs> still got our life up heart intact. I think, let me go ahead and pop on over here. We finally reached the main courtyard. This looks like still quite a gauntlet to climb. So I think for right now, I'm going to go ahead and end things off here. And next time, whensoever that may be, here's our moon rock, hell yeah. <laughs> Whenever that may be, we are going to explore the last little, the last stretch of Bowser's Keep here, I suppose. And whatever, what is, that, what is going on back there? There's some big old windstorm shaking the battlefield over there. I don't know, we're going to find that out, I guess. But for now, thank you everyone so much for watching. Join me next time for... I don't know if next time will be the fight with Bowser, or pro it probably won't be, because there's a lot to unpack in this area by the looks of things, but it's fast approaching. Thanks everyone for watching. This is Argon Matrix, signing out. Thank you and good night.